Hey, hey everyone, Krellpix here. And today I thought I would show you a bit more detail of my new uh, toolkit. So I have upgraded. <laughs> well, not necessarily upgraded, but I have expanded. So thanks to Danny from, the, from my Facebook group and assisted by Allison, a fellow Aussie, I have now uh, the giant bee tray. Woohoo! and the uh, magical harbor freight storage system and it is magical <laughs> so um i'll go with the tray first um as you i'm pretty sure everybody has seen this tray by now um some other youtubers have talked about this tray and i have firmly uh jumped on that bandwagon and i must say that it is incredible it's got higher sides I'm constantly spilling my diamonds when I shake them, you know, to line them up on the tray. Constantly spilling them. This has the higher side, so I haven't been doing... I actually haven't spilled any so far just by shaking it. I have spilled it, pouring them back in, but that's... I don't think that's the tray. <laughs> and it, of course, holds a lot more diamonds. And now, even if I only need, like maybe 10 diamonds on my section that I'm working on, I tend to pour in a lot more diamonds just to see it because it looks so nice when they're all lined up on the tray and everything, so. Yeah, it's a little bit overkill, but the functionality of the tray is great, especially for me who, you know, spills diamonds all the time. This is very helpful for me, so I'm very glad to have this now. It is very nice. I just need to wipe it down, I think, with some uh, dryer sheet. And because I find that some of the diamonds stick a little bit, but again, not an issue with the product. <laughs> very excited. I recommend people get this. <laughs> now, next up is this storage system. I ordered uh, six of these and I needed help from the Facebook group from Danny and I because at the time this is from Harbor Freight and they didn't deliver to Australia they deliver to Australia now apparently but I still think the shipping is a bit ridiculous so she was kind enough to order these I ordered six of these sets and because I just didn't want to run out uh, they're ridiculously cheap they're about they're less than five USD per set stupidly cheap so um yeah i got six of those and they are pretty cool i am a little concerned because they are cheap and uh looking at the hinges and the latches and stuff they seem like they would break pretty easily but that being said i could be wrong and they could last for a very long time now there are 24 no wait yep 24 of these little boxes inside this one big box these boxes look so tiny i didn't expect this to be so small but <laughs> here you go it's so tiny and it's just so cute and it's got the little it's got a latch and it's got the lid but they hold so much so i'm very pleased at that uh, they actually hold more than the small ones of the Elizabeth Ward. Actually, let me pull one of those out for you. So the Elizabeth Ward system is this here. And this holds more than this one. So it's pretty cool. Um, like I would have to use two of these, to, I think, to accommodate or three of these even to accommodate the amount that this one holds so it's pretty good um, and it takes up less space so I'm very excited about this and they were very easy to label so I'm using these with the golden dragon now I made a photocopy of the legend on the side because they didn't come with the inventory sheet so I made a photocopy of the legend cut that up and then I just kind of glued it to the side there I was decide debating on which side to put that on to. I don't know if I want to do it on the top or sorry, on the front or the back. We'll have a think about it. <laughs> not <laughs> like it's not a big decision. It's not a big deal. Or even just to 
I was thinking of just putting them on top, but then I don't like having them stacked on top of each other. I like to be able to see them in a row. So I probably will stick with putting them on the front. But yeah, overall, I'm very happy with this scent. I'm glad I got so many. I'm glad I got six. I mean, that's only 30 US bucks. And that's roughly the price of one Elizabeth Ward set, I believe. So I feel like it was a very good deal, even if one breaks after a lot of usage. And that has to be a lot of usage. I've got backups. <laughs> but yeah, I recommend it. If you don't have a storage system or if you're looking for something different and um, something compact, because this takes up a lot less table space than the Elizabeth Ward one as well. Um, so I recommend getting this. as, And I will put a link to this set in the box below these trays were gotten off of aliexpress they're pretty easy to find now so i won't have a link for this one but yeah that is my expanded tool set now uh this is where i'm currently at so i will be continuing to use the elizabeth ward ones but i think i will use that mostly for the small quick diamond paintings i still have quite a few of those and then i also have some <laughs> other projects uh that require tiny containers so i might use elizabeth ward for that as well so i uh, i do not regret this purchase don't get me wrong still a great product and it's still quite handy to use and i loved using it on uh, alice but yeah this is a very nice set we'll see how it goes after time but yeah so excited very happy thank you so much danny thank you so much allison and yeah i hope everyone has enjoyed this video let me know if you have either one of these projects or products <laughs> and what your thoughts are on them do you recommend them do you not like them and if you don't like them what do you not like so that uh, maybe I can keep an eye on that as well in case you know something happens and then my whole project is ruined really don't want that so yeah I hope everyone has enjoyed and I will see you in the next video bye